Hello and welcome to I Love Trading. So today somebody asked me a question in regards to Wondershare Fulmora and BeastGamerTV dash MM Gamey ask, can you put text on a split screen video? Yes, you can. Also, can you have three videos play the sound or audio the same time? Yes, you can. Or does it have to be only one video sound? Okay, it doesn't. You can play multiple, you can have, we can put on multiple videos on a split screen. It can be two videos, three, four, five, six, seven, eight videos, or even more videos. And we can have every single one of those video play the audio all at the same time. And I know why you asked this question too. Because if you go into the split screen templates, like right here, and I, let me look for three videos here, and we'll do the same thing. Uh, okay, so here's one with three videos. I'm just going to guess this is something that you want right here. Now, if you're using the template here, you cannot use audio for more than one video. You have to choose one video where you want the audio to come from. You cannot use it for multiple videos. Now, how do you get around that? We have to do a what's called a PIP, a picture-in-picture. -picture. Very easy to do. And let me show you how to do that. Now, I am using a MacBook here, but of course you can use a Windows PC. Most of you will probably have a Windows PC using this Filmora application, uh, but it's very, very similar between a um, using Filmora on a Mac versus a, uh, a Windows PC. So let's do this now. Let's go ahead and first thing you need to do <clears throat> is have three videos. So each video what we're gonna do is we're gonna drag and we're gonna drop it onto the PIP timeline, not the regular timeline up here. So let me go ahead and I'm gonna take some guesses here. Let's just, Here's one video here. So I'm going to drag, I'm going to drop this. Now I'm not going to put it here. I'm going to put it one down. This is the PIP timeline right here. You see the picture right here is basically, I mean, PIP stands for picture in picture. So here's one video. Let's grab another video. I'm, I'm going to put it on the second PIP timeline. So let's grab another video here. Uh, how about, <clears throat> uh, here's another video here. Oh, that's a six minute video. Let me go something a little bit smaller. Uh, how about, okay, here's a video. Let me drag, I'm gonna drop this one here to the second pip line and let's do one more. Here's another video here. I'm gonna go ahead and drag and drop this one down here. Okay, so here we go. So we have three videos. They're all on the pip timeline and the audio should be playing for all of them right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and press on play and we should hear the audio from all three videos. Hello everybody. Hey, everybody so doing I just wanna show you so how you can want to make a quick quick review on mouse is. cursor. Okay, perfect. So we got that problem solved. Now, if you wanted only to have the audio out of two videos, uh, you can basically just m mute a video as well. So for example, for this middle video here, if I didn't want the audio there, you can just right click on it and you can just click on mute down here. Okay. So anyways, we're going to have all three videos playing at the same time. Now what I got to do is I have to rearrange these manually. And I believe it was, um, it was one big video on top and two small ones on the bottom. So Here's one video here. So let me go ahead and you can see the lime green uh, outline here. So I'm gonna move my cursor until you get that double arrow on both sides. So I'm just gonna go ahead and resize this right there. And then I'm gonna click on this window again and I'm gonna resize the next video here, just like that. And then I think it was something like, it was a video down here. And another video was like down here as well. Let me grab this video. Let me resize this one here. Actually, this one was a was just a big video here. So let me just keep this one like up here. So this is the one that I'm gonna the big video that I'm gonna keep all the way up here. And let me just widen this up. So basically, the entire screen is gonna be filled. Okay. So now you can see now the only problem I have is like these two videos are behind this big video here, okay? So I want it the other way around. I want these two small videos to show and this video, the big video to be the background. So what you have to do is we have to rearrange the PIP order. So what we can do is we can simply move this, this the big uh, video here. Let me just move it up here. And then I'm gonna drag this one here where I have the green screen. I'm gonna be doing video on this too, on this green screen here. I paid five dollars here. You can make a green screen, and you'd be surprised how professional a video will look, recording off of a uh, like an iPhone six and a five dollar green screen. 
But uh, anyways, and of course using it through a Wondershare Filmora. Okay, so now I got this like in the background. Now you can see that this part is in the background and these two videos are in the front. Okay, so now what I gotta do now is I, have to, I just have to resize these. I'm not gonna do everything perfect here, okay? I'm basically gonna just give you the gist on how to do it. So let me highlight this video here. And let's move that over like a little bit. And you can tell like, um, you, you see this white line here and this blue line and this red line. You can kind of like figure out like where the middle is and like the sides. So basically I have this now. Now let me go ahead and just press on play. Hello everybody. Hey, everybody so doing? I just want to show you so how you just want to make a quick review of mouse cursor, Samsung. Okay, now you also did um, ask the question in regarding to text. Can you put text on these three videos? Yes. I'm not sure exactly what you mean that by that, but we'll do a couple examples here. So here we go. Here is three videos and let me just do this because each video here is is a different in length. So let me just go ahead and just make all these clip the uh, same size. So let me just go ahead and delete the end of this one here. Delete, let me highlight this. Let me go ahead and split it right here. I'm gonna right click, I'm gonna delete this as well. So all, so this whole entire clip is all gonna be uh, the same duration, okay. So now let's go ahead and include text. And what we can do is you wanna click on the T up here on the, I think it's the same thing on the windows, is T up here. And then you just wanna find whatever text you wanna put in here. Actually, it doesn't really matter, but we're just gonna click on common here and we're just gonna guess the text, okay? So we'll go ahead and use this one. Let me double click on that one. Okay, this is the animation here. It doesn't matter with the animation because we can, we're gonna change all that anyway. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag, I'm gonna drop this into the T for text, okay? And now what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna go ahead and extend the text out if you want to, I mean, all the way to the end of this video. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna double click on this text here. And then this window will pop up. I think on the windows, you're gonna double click on the text and then a window will pop up and then you have to click on advanced. Okay, once you click on advanced and you have something like this window here. Okay, from here, we can put the text anywhere we want and we can put multiple text on here as well. So let me just go ahead and delete this. It's highlighted right now. Let me go ahead and delete this. And then let's go ahead and add a new text in here. So I'm gonna add text right here. And let's see here. Uh, you're a gamer, so I don't know. Let's name uh, something uh, po Pokemon. Pokemon. I always get that wrong. So let's put it here and let's go ahead and use a preset here. And so if I play it, that sound's not gonna play in this preview window here, okay? We have to okay and play it from the original side, but let me just play it and see how it looks, okay. So here's a text here. Of course, we can put the text on all three videos kind of like this as well, but I think what you're saying is maybe each video. So we'll go ahead and do that. So let me go ahead and drop this over here. So we have Pokemon right here. And let's put another, let's put another um, text in here. And I'm gonna put green. And of course you can change the, um, the font size and everything. So let's just change something here. Let's just, we'll just go with, uh, I'll just chalk duster here. So we'll call this one green screen and I'll enlarge this a little bit. Okay, and I'll leave it like that. And if I press on play here, now these don't have any animation on. If you want animation on here, we can just highlight this text here. We can go to animation right here. And we can make it any animation we want up here. If you just basically hover over it, you can kind of see an example of what it's gonna look like. You have to double click. So let's do this for this uh, Pokemon. Let's do a fly and zoom, something like this. And then for this one here, this green screen, we'll do uh, this little droppy thing here. And then we'll add one more text for up here. And I'll call this one, let's call this one Filmora, and let me go to preset, and we'll make this one this yellow color um, preset here, and we can enlarge this as well. We'll just leave it like here, just just for example purposes. Let's just put that right there, and we'll go to. Uh, and of course, you can customize all these uh, texts as well. You can put like borders on it, like shadows. You can do all kinds of things on here. You can even do like 
uh, gradient color where it's like yellow, then it turns like more and more red. Anyways, we'll go to animation here and we'll just guess another animation. How about something like this? Okay, so let me go ahead and press on play here. Oops, what did I just do here? I hope I saved that. Let me just click on that. Okay. Hello, everybody. Hey, everybody so doing? I just want to show you how so, you I just can to see make a quick review. review. Okay, so you've seen how all the text had their own particular animation. Now, it's a little bit choppy right now, but of course, uh, if you're using Windershare, you know, when you're doing a, a lot of intensive stuff on here, it's going to be a little bit like laggy, just pretty much like any other software. I mean, depending on how powerful your computer is. But after you render it, or basically after you export it, once you play it, everything is going to be nice and dandy. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys uh, subscribe, I'm going to be showing how you can make video, really cool video outros. Uh, you know, I had the subscribe button or a bunch of different videos where people could click at the end of your video, uh, video intros. Um, I mean, a lot of things I want to show for more. And a lot of things on this green screen, too. I have, I did a lot of experiments in regards to the green screen. I spent five hour green screen. I spent ones that were $50. And really, they all look and work exactly the same way. So anyways, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys.